Hi everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, I'm excited to show you how to create a small kitchen using Forneo. Let's start by building the room. First, we use the room tool to create the walls according to our dimensions. This makes it so much easier to build our space accurately. Adding windows and doors, we'll start by placing a window. Then, select the window and use the edit tool to change its dimensions. Next, we'll go to the catalog and select a door that we like and place it. Then, change the dimensions according to our space. Switching to 3D mode, we can adjust the window and door using the guideline tool. This helps us get the perfect fit. Now, let's apply some color to the walls. We'll go to textures, select one, and apply it to all walls. We'll do the same for the floor texture, using the copy tool to apply it where needed. This really brings our design to life. From the catalog, we can start placing kitchen appliances one by one. Let's add a chimney. We expand the catalog to see options, choose one, and add it to the space, then resize it according to the space. Next, we'll use the Create New Project tool in 3D mode. Using the Rectangle tool, we draw the shapes for our kitchen cabinets with the help of the push-pull tool. Now, we place the base cabinets using the resize and move tools. We'll use wall cubes from the catalog to build wall cabinets. We adjust their size to fit our space and place them on the walls. From the catalog, we pick a slab and place it on the base cabinets. Then, we adjust it to fit the available space. After that, we choose shutters from the catalog and place them on all the cabinets. Let's give the cabinets some texture. Go to the textures, upload an image from the gallery, and apply it to all the cabinets. Now, we add a marble texture to the counter slab. This gives our kitchen a unique look. Add texture to the refrigerator and other appliances. We go to the catalog and select a sink. We place the sink in the space, adjust it, and use the punch tool.
Then, we add tiles texture to the kitchen wall and adjust the tiling of the texture, then clone it to the other wall. Next, we add handles from the catalog. We rotate them and set them on the cabinets. Then use the group tool to place them on all the cabinets. We also add an island counter from the catalog. We place pendant lights above the island counter. Switching to 2D mode. In ceiling plan mode, we add a ceiling light and adjust it. Back in 3D mode, select bar stools from the catalog. We add bar stools, rotate them, and clone them. Then, we select a plant and place it on the island. And add kitchen accessories from the catalog. Finally, we go into render mode, set the lighting and environment, and take a preview. We save the view and take a 12K render. And there you have it. Our small kitchen design project is complete. Thank you for watching.